board uh, the 1966 Route Master from Brooklyn. Someone has already asked me regarding the bell. It's my only communication with the driver, so please, I ask you, don't ring the bell. It confuses him. How are you going to swear at me, man? You did all your pano last night. Hi, Mum! <laughs> Well, I really Thanks. hope Andy and I be really, really Thanks. happy. <laughs> Good afternoon ladies and gentlemen. It's a pleasure to welcome you all aboard Concorde and a special welcome to Jo and Caroline on this their wedding day. My name is Jenny Edwards. It's my privilege to conduct the ceremony for you today and this is my colleague Jilly Reed, who is registering the marriage. Andrew, you have escorted Caroline here today. Are you willing to give her hand to Jo? in the knowledge that he will be a kind and loving husband and take good care of her throughout their married life. True? Yes, I am. Thank you. Please take your seats.
Joe and Caroline are here to formally pledge their love, to be united in marriage and to offer each other the security that comes from promises sincerely made and faithfully kept. They are choosing to make a commitment to each other for the rest of their lives. This ceremony provides the opportunity to bring friends and family together to celebrate the happiness of Joe and Caroline. We are here to witness what is at heart a private moment between them as they dedicate themselves to each other. I'd like to start the ceremony today with our reading and I'd like to invite Colin forward, please. If you go to a wedding, here's what it means. No one wears trainers and no one wears jeans. Your best new clothes are all that you wear and everyone in your whole family is there even some cousins that you may, you've never known and the grown-ups all say oh how you have grown so everyone's sitting on one big plane except Caroline and Joe, the bride and the groom Then all of a sudden things quieten down the music starts playing and people turn round and really slowly Caroline walks in and she's prettier now than she's ever been she is a beauty and she really looking good today when normally she just looks okay <laughs> she walks in and stands with her dad for a while as Joe, her boyfriend, waits in the aisle. His hair is all combed and he's wearing a tie and then Caroline's mum starts to sniffle and cry. And now it comes time for the get married part. The registrar says that we're ready to start. So she talks and she talks about serious things and their friend Sean steps up holding two rings. He gives one to the groom, the other to the bride. Then his wife Lauren pulls him aside. And Caroline and Joe kind of look at each other. Another big sniffle comes from Caroline's mother. <laughs> and Caroline and Joe put on the wedding rings and they talk and they promise each other some things. They promise that they'll love each other a lot and help one another no matter what. And be with each other for the rest of their life then the registrar says, now you are husband and wife. Then everyone's in such a big happy mood and you go to a party with very much food where you dance with some grown-ups and drink some wine and then do a conga dance in one long line till Caroline and Joe drive off in a car and everyone's thinking how happy they are. So we all yell goodbye and throw handfuls of rice then the whole thing is over. Aren't weddings nice? Thank you, Colin. I promise not to talk and talk, <laughs> as no legal objection has been declared against your ceremony, it may now take place. Now, although your guests know you very well, the law requires that you fully identify yourselves so Joe, could I have your full name please? Joseph Day. Thank you. And Caroline, your full name? Caroline Louise Lambert. Thank you. The place in which you are now met has been duly sanctioned according to law for the celebration of marriages. Before you are joined in matrimony, I have to remind you of the solemn and binding character of the vows you are about to make. Marriage in this country means the union of two people voluntarily entered into for life to the exclusion of all others. Joe and Caroline, I'm now going to ask each of you in turn to declare that there is no legal reason why you should not be married today. It's a question of repeating after me. Joe, you've got to talk nice and loudly so that your witnesses can hear, okay? I declare that I know I declare that I know of no legal reason of no legal reason why I Joseph Day why I Joseph Day may not be joined in marriage may not be joined in marriage to Caroline Louise Lambert to Caroline Louise Lambert that's lovely just want to check that the witnesses could hear that yeah lovely Caroline you've got to do the same yeah. I <laughs> 
I declare that I know. I declare that I know. Of no legal reason. Of no legal reason. Why I, Caroline, Caroline Louise Lambert. Why I, Caroline Louise Lambert. May not be joined in marriage. May not be joined in marriage. To Joseph Day. To Joseph Day. Lovely. Now the solemn moment has come for Caroline and Joe to contract their marriage, which will unite them as husband and wife. Can you turn to face each other? Do you want to pass your flowers to your mum? And hold hands. Joe, can you repeat after me? Again, nice and loudly so you all can hear. I, Joseph Day. I, Joseph Day. Take you, Caroline Louise Lambert. Take you, Caroline Louise Lambert. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. Thank you. Caroline. I, Caroline Louise Lambert. Take you, Joseph Day. Take you, Joseph Day. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. Thank you. You have gathered about you those you love, and in their presence will you reply, I do, to the following promises. So you first, Joe. Do you promise to love, respect, comfort and protect Caroline, and to share with her all that you are and all that is yet to be? I do. Thank you. Caroline. Do you promise to love, respect, comfort and protect Joe and to share with him all that you are and all that is yet to be? Okay. Thank you. <laughs> we now come to the exchange of rings, so I'd like to invite Sean forward. Just hang on to them for a second. The ring has long been a symbol of vows taken in marriage and although these rings are beautiful in their own right, it's the bond of love they represent that makes them truly priceless. These rings, chosen with love and care, are the outward sign of the promises you have made today. If you can pass um, Joe Caroline's ring. Slip it onto the third finger of her left hand. It's your photographer, I want to get this one. Do you want to get this? And Joe, repeat after me. Caroline, with this ring. Caroline, with this ring. I promise to be true to you. I promise to be true to, to you. To support you. To support you. And to be there when you need me most. And to be there when you need me most. I give you my hand. I give you my hand. My heart. My heart. And my love. And my love. Thank you. Thank you. I'm <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. Does <laughs> <laughs> that ring there, my God? Sean, can you, that's it, lovely, thank you. <laughs> you slip it onto the third finger of Joseph's hand. And again, repeating <laughs> after, is it going to go? Yeah, <laughs> Again, repeating after me. Joe, with this ring. Joe, with this ring. I promise to be true to you. I promise to be true to, to you. To support you. To support you. And to be there when you need me most. And to be there when you need me most. I give you my hand. My, my heart, my heart, and my love. And my love. Thank you. Don't say that. <laughs> Joe and Caroline, your marriage is a celebration of the love you have for each other, a partnership of tenderness and compassion, and is based on mutual trust and respect. When two people pledge to love and care for each other in marriage, they create an identity unique to themselves which binds them closer than any written or spoken word. You have made the declarations that are required by law. You've made a solemn and binding contract in front of your witnesses, your friends and families here today. Therefore, I'm very happy to tell you that from this time forward, you are husband and wife. Congratulations and Joe, you may kiss your wife. That concludes the ceremony today, ladies and gentlemen. It might take a few minutes for us to organise the signing of the register, so we'd just be grateful for your patience. Thank you. Okay, while you two are here together, one last pleasure of mine is to present you both with your marriage certificate. So congratulations to you. Hope you have a very, very long Follow that way. <laughs> Thank you.
Oh, you're right. Please, from the back. But... 